Hi there and welcome. Today we're going to take a look at the site administration and how you can add the recorder to TinyMCE and record your screen. So let's go into TinyMCE and then um, manage it. So we'll go into settings. What we're looking for is to make sure that we have record enabled. Next, we're going to go into settings. And then notice here, we're going to hit screen. Otherwise, it won't do it. Next, we're going to add some more time. So audio limit, I think uh, 10 minutes is fine. Video five is fine. And the screen, we're going to add 30 minutes. I know that's a lot. Now notice here the size, uh, we don't want it too large, even though it's going to be this large. Allow pausing, I think that's always a good idea. And then we're going to save and that's it. Now we are ready, well, teachers are ready to use the tool. So this is for the admin. If we go into a course, we're going to go into, we'll open this up. Okay, reveal two rows, maximize it. And then we're going to go into video record menu and screen record. Now we're going to choose. Now you've got Chrome tab window, the entire screen. We're going to go into Chrome. And this time we'll go into Magic School. I love Magic School. So there it is. Uh, this is where I summarize videos, so you can see what that looks like. All right, so next we're going to uh, not stop screen sharing. We're going to go back here because we are going to start recording. Okay, we can also pause. Next, we're going to go what we want to screen share, which is this. All right, and then we don't stop sharing ever. We go back into the tab and only stop here. All right, and then we attach it, and here we go. It's huge, so we can click on it on one end and make it smaller if we wish, which isn't going to make much of a difference because it's going to be big anyways. Or we can go into Tools, Source Code, and then make it smaller. Notice the width, my goodness, <laughs> is uh, too much. We'll make it 500 by 327 and then save so it's half decent. We can also center it. There we are. And now we'll save changes and see what it looks like. And you can see it's huge except for the middle part, which is the recording. And now we can play it. Recording. Okay, we can also pause. Next, we're going to go what we want. Okay, so that was it. That's our screen recorder straight from the editor. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll be happy to answer. <music>